Hello everybody, welcome back to Pranny Gaming. And we are playing Clash Royale today, as you all know, you can see it on your screens and we are back with my new account. I mean, why do I say new account always? I'll uh my main account which is this one. I got uh, demoted so badly, I mean I was first up the league uh, reset, the trophy league reset. But let's just open this. This is called a plentiful golden crate if you don't know. I don't know these names and uh, according to my knowledge, I think the higher uh, crate than this is the overflowing golden crate if I am not wrong. And I think we are going to find it after uh, after some time. What to use this one? Uh, Valkyrie is the best option with the current cards but uh, I am not going to give so much importance to that because the mini Pekka is going to be maxed out probably in this season when I get the pass royal. Probably. So we are not playing battles today and you could see my golem deck. I said it in the previous video. I am trying so many things because I am not able to win easily. So we will fight for that giant chest in this episode. So the executioner's kitchen. I forgot to tell that if you don't know. And those are the guards which are new. It's, it's a new now. It's, it's totally changed. If you... Oh uh, no, the balance changes. What do I go here? I'll go for mini Pekka. Yes, yes, I'll go mini Pekka and uh, see, guys. Um, executioner is five elixir, and most of the people will say that it's costly. And but I believe uh, that the executioner is the right option to go to. Uh, but sometimes, oh, let's go for this big push here. I'm going for it, please. Yes, he defend. I think he'll defend it. And if he defends it well, we are in trouble. What the heck? Come on, get that rascals out. Those, get those rascals out, and then slowly we can get the musket. And look at that minion! My goodness, it the only one million took out a whole goblin cage, and we lost this game. My goodness, I rushed so much. I've been playing in my new account. I've not played with these cards much and... What a bad loss. And without seeing, I uh, just press that uh, angry emote. I've, that's what I've been using on my main account. I've been using only the angry emote most of the time because I've, I'm having such a bad time over here. I'm not able to win many games. Not be it anywhere in the battles or uh, you know in uh, these challenges I have not been able to win easily and that's why uh, it's been such a bad time and I've been uh, using that uh, angry emote and by using it so many times I've been used to it and I didn't see it I just pressed it because I knew I knew its position oh my goodness what is this oh, that was a waste of a fire spirit Oh, almost at Prince Charge on my uh, tower, so that was a near escape. I love the Royal Delivery, it's a great card and now he's got equal damage on both the crown towers. Yeah, he's having the lead, he's in the lead, but I feel this game is going better than the last one. Okay, so this guy is going to, this guy has a really uh, fast cycle deck, so he's going to be cycling his wall breakers many times and Oh, and he has counters for the goblin barrel too. So this game is going to be hard again. Maybe one more loss. I'm not sure. I'm not liking this. Come on, get that, get that wizard out. Most importantly, the cannon cards HP is going to be good here. Gets it out. Okay, so one more time is gone for the wall breakers. I think it was a waste. Nope, it was. That's why I love this card. Troll delivery. It, it, you know, reaches the arena late, but still, uh, it covers a lot of damage. So I love the card, but it can, I think, uh, reach the arena a little bit more quicker. And it has a high range, so that's also another good quality. Okay, so I can't go Goblin uh, Drill because he's gone for the Mega Minion. And the Goblin Drill was probably the most popular card when it was released, and now not many people use it. So. I'll go, I'll form my own goblin gang, just like that, but 
Yeah, not a not a huge. Uh, I think that prince should not charge. Yes, good. And now I'll go cannon guard in front of that executioner, and I'm ignoring that wall breakers. It's a brave decision, but I'm going. Okay. So get that wizard out. No, oh my word, what a card this wizard is. It got both the executioner and the cannon cart out. Wow. And I'll go executioner here. Please don't. One of them got it. I don't know how, but. Oh. It's been so frustrating for me. And I probably, you know, unlocked that uh, common wild cards trophy road. Uh, reward probably around maybe uh, five day, four or five days back but i have not claimed it because i'm in uh, i i'm in uh, fear that i may lose and you know i and i'll go back and i wanted to i wanted to show you guys so i didn't play because of that reason so it's been really bad come on prince please don't charge even it yeah it has a wizard behind it and it's going to do everything and uh, win win in the game easy oh my god look at that wizard again what a card it is now what do we do two losses and um, and actually five losses if i want to be precise i've continued here i've given 50 gems to continue my goodness i want that legendary chest just just to get a legendary man or a legendary wild card i don't know Okay, this is a better deck. This looks better. This looks low elixir. I purposely didn't go for the rocket because I I wanted to uh, try something new. I've been using this phrase so many times now. Okay, so I have I have the hunter and he will definitely have something like a lava wound or a golem or. Maybe something that was a lag there, but not a huge lag. There you go. As I said, he, I told you he'll have a high HP card which uh, and a high HP win condition. So there it is. The high HP win condition. The big, 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 big golem. And because we have the hunter, it's not going to do much for the next time. But this time, it's going to do much. I'm, and as you know, I'm using it in my deck. It's my favorite card right now. Okay. So now I'll go Goblin Drill to just make that Magic Archer retarget and this game is going very well for us. Much, much better than the last game. Get those minions out first. Yes, thank you Executioner. Yeah, the Executioner and the Hunter which is quite strange. And he has the rocket, remember? He's not used it yet, I think. Oh, there he uses it. Short, short uh, rocket get those executioners out i don't think that's a good move uh, but yeah he was in danger and he knew it he wanted to protect his king tower and now his king tower has a lesser hp than his princess tower which is on the left so that's the damage the executioners can do that's why i love the card but i i think it's deserved to be four alex and more than five because it's five many people don't use it I'll actually go Hunter here, that's tra- Oh my god, look at the timing, I sent it, he sent it at the perfect second when I sent the Hunter and look at this, the Golem will come back, it will just change, it, it will turn around and come back along with the Alexis Golem, look at that. <laughs> Many people would think that's my Golem but that's not mine, that's his red great Golem which is made of red stones and it's not- Oh my god, he has two win conditions! And he gave us the hunter. I don't understand. Uh, I don't uh, understand this. I uh, and he has three actually with the ice golem too. So I why did he not take the hunter? Okay. So come on. Oh my God! What is this? Ah yeah, we we are going to win this. Probably one more show. Where is our royal ghost? Is good. He finished it. Okay. So executioner here. Yes, yeah, that's one. Finish it. Yes, yeah, that's a finally a good win. I have not won since uh, I think I didn't uh, win any recent games. Played in this main account and that's a giant chest. Thank you so much. Come on. That's gold. That's the best thing from this chest. Always. Wild, epic wild card. I, okay. Raw delivery. Okay. 
and a furnace. Oh, nice chest actually. Skeletons was a card, which was okay, but oh no problem. Now we have the furnace. I think we got the furnace. Yes, and the common wild card, the common uh, trade token is the next. So let's go for this battle, which is going to be our last, and probably. I mean, uh, let's just give our best. Okay, so we have the win. Um, we have the momentum, so we can't lose this game. Okay, Ma I'm, I went musketeer and I've got the arrows, and it's going to be good with the minion horde. And I'm going e giant because look at the other three cards. It just uh, sums up to eight elixir, and the e giant is of course eight elixir. So I'll go for it. Okay, let's just copy his emotes. Arrows, bad. Ah, I wasted it on a very poor goblin barrel. But we have other counters for the goblin. Uh, I mean, the minion hall too. We have the executioner there. We have the musketeer, which can counter the minion hall quite well. Not, not too well, but not bad too. So even he has the wizard, which is annoying me a lot. And this is a arena one uh, matchup, knight versus musketeer. As you all know, if you watched my arena two videos, this was a very very huge matchup. And that e giant is going to finish the electro wizard, and I'll just back it up with this electro spirit if needed. No, no, it was not needed. It didn't do anything. Oh my God! I missed the arrows again. Whoa! I've I've used the arrows twice in this game, and both the times I've used it very badly. Oh yeah, he used the goblin barrel badly for uh, twice. First time it was better, but this time it was even worse than that. Okay. Come on, that musketeer did a great job of finishing those firecrackers, and it's going to get to. Why did he use a snowball on that bomber? He could have used it on his musketeer, and the snowball guys also is uh, is changed a little bit. It pushes the troops uh, even more back, so that's that's uh, quite a good quite a good change made by Supercell. Okay. This is a good hand, and I've not used my battle ram yet. I am not going to use it too, because uh, he has good, quite good counters for that. I want to uh, just uh, give more, uh, put more pressure on him by using my electro giant. Oh, that wizard didn't retarget. What are you talking about? That wizard didn't retarget, and the goblin drill. If you observe there, it spawns uh, one, uh, one goblin less than it was spawning. Uh, so. That's another balance change made by Supercell again, and there have been some good changes. But the most uh, look change and the most known change for people is the guards change, according to me. And that's a really good change. The guards deserve more respect than they are deserving, than they are getting it now. That's the tower, and now our uh, main goal should be to defend this tower. And the goblin's hand also is not that great a card; we can defend it easily. Oh yes, that wizard is gone. Thank you so much. And get those out. Yes, that goblin barrel didn't do much. And we should win this comfortably. Yes, I'll use the battle ram in the last 10 seconds. Can you believe that? Oh, that wizard didn't target the goblin uh, drill, and he's using the minion horn for the first time. So both of us. Myself and my opponent, both of us used the the minion horde and the battle ram in our last uh, in the last ten seconds, and that's how you finish a class trial video by winning it comprehensively like that. And yes, as I said, we are finishing this video here. I'll see you in the next one, and subscribe, which is down below, like, which is up, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.